Introduce yourself. I am Jessa. How long have you been training? Almost two years. Two years. I started when I was 37. So, no, I was 38. I was 38. And uh, now I'm 40. And, uh, you don't look a year past 25. <laughs> Thank you. I but, really appreciate it. Yes. <laughs> that's, I mean that. Um, so how, how did you find the art of jiu-jitsu? You know, a friend pointed it out to me. Um, they were they train up in the city or used to and uh, talking about it a lot. And they were like, you should try it, you should try it. And they found this gym. And I promised myself I would go to three classes. And I said, if I hate it after three classes, then I don't have to go again. And I loved it after three classes. So. Wow, that's awesome. <laughs> Was there something kind of like missing in your life that you needed to find something that you know that will give you what jiu-jitsu gave you of course i think um i think all of us i'll speak for myself but yes i think a lot of people do come here because something is missing. but for mm. me um i'm very open about it so i'll, I'll say it here i'm in recovery um i'm four years sober and um it, it's hard you know when you take that part out of your life it's, it's hard to meet people mm. um, besides if you have a 12-step program or, or something like that which i do um you know there's there's certain people you meet there but you want other aspects of your life yes and you want people who are trying to better themselves uh that you can meet yes and not a bar <laughs> yes so this filled that sort of void for me um i came here Everybody's working on something. Everybody's working on something in themselves. Um, not necessarily recovery, obviously, but everybody was doing what I wanted to do and learning a technique and a skill in the process. And that really spoke to me. Um, this skill and art that we're learning, for me, it, it increases my coordination, it increases my body confidence, um, movement, strength. Um, you know, it, it does a lot for me that I can fill my mind space with rather than my racing thoughts. And everybody seems to be doing the same thing with that, so it's a good community for me. That is, that is, that is um, really touching that you share that with us. Um, I'm sure, you know, everyone, like you said, are going through uh, battles that jiu-jitsu are able to help them cope with and get through it and you're a prime example of that and it's great that you found the art of jiu-jitsu and which improved your life and i'm sure now that it has gotten a lot better for you it really has um this this is definitely something i want to stick with especially this school here um gary school uh, chris saab is our head instructor yes. they're amazing they're great they really know their stuff yes. <laughs> absolutely and they're just so welcoming and, and open and just so willing to teach um there's all the coaches here are so willing to teach and you know just ready to sit down and talk with you and they're just like awesome people and it's just a really great environment the vibe in this gym is amazing well just so well Thank you for, for sharing your journey with us. And I'm sure um, if your story is heard out there that you will encourage others to, to do what you did and, and, and practice the art and improve people's lives and, and, and be better, better people. Thank you.